at Sarah with Raining Hot Coupons and um, I just kind of wanted to show you guys um, how my life is like when I'm looking for hot deals and posting them on my website and um, <laughs> that I'm always here um, behind the scenes holding my little two-year-old. He always likes to <laughs> help me find good deals. <laughs> He's really funny. So um, he wanted to be on the camera for a minute. I was trying to film um, why you need filler items. I've got I got a request asking if I can explain filler items for Walgreens and why you need them. So um, I'm gonna I'm gonna explain that in my video <laughs> in a second. Okay, so I'm back now, and I hope you guys enjoyed that funny little entertaining video clip. Uh, but anyway, I'm gonna show you guys today what filler items are and why you need them for Walgreens. So I'm just going to show you an, a deal. It's not a current deal or anything, but um, it's just an example. So let's say you've, you're getting this box of oatmeal, okay, and then you have your coupon for this box. Now, let's say you want to use a register reward. Um, now, really fast, I don't have any register rewards to show you guys because um, I like to spend them the day that I get them usually. Um, I'll spend them on, I'll do like separate transactions. That way I have to spend less out of pocket. Um, but anyway, I'm going to show you an example. This is basically what they look like, and um, they're printed from the little Catalina machine, and they're about that size. Oops, they're about this size, and they're going to say like register reward, Walgreens, um, the amount, the expiration date, and all of that. So let's pretend that this is a register reward. So now you've got your item and you've got your coupon, but you want to use your register reward. So we can, you can do that, that's fine, but what's going to happen is notice how you have two coupons. They consider the register reward a coupon. So you've got your two coupons, but you only have one item. And that is why you need a filler item to basically fulfill this coupon. Um, so that's when I go through the store. Um, before I get to the cash register, I'll usually find like little filler items, just you know, inexpensive items. But uh, these little candies are found at the register and they're only 25 cents. So um, I take these candies, I'll usually grab a bunch of them, or sometimes during the holidays they have like the little tumbler cups, the little plastic ones, and they're about 25 cents to 50 cents, and you can use those as filler items too. But just find some inexpensive items and grab a bunch of them, not a bunch, but grab a few of them, take them to the register, and um, so that way when you're, when you're checking out and you've got your, your item with your coupon, and then you've got your register reward, now you have this item, which is your filler item, so now you have two items, one and two, and you've got two coupons, so you're good to go. Um, a good way to remember if you're going to need a filler item or not is, let's say you're going to use this register reward with just this item, and you don't have a coupon for this item, then you would be fine because this register reward or coupon would work for your one item. Um, so basically, anytime you have a register reward that you are going to use with an item that has a coupon, you are going to need a filler item. Um, I hope that makes sense. I know it's kind of confusing and it's kind of hard to explain, but once you get the hang of it, once you've done it a few times, um, you'll start knowing when you need to have your filler items. And if not, worst case, like I said, you can just grab a bunch of the candies or um, inexpensive items and take them with you. And if the couch register beeps, then most likely you need a filler item. And sometimes you're going to need a few filler items, depending on how many items you have in your cart with coupons. And usually if you're going to have like a, if, you have, if your entire cart is filled with items that all have coupons, then you are going to need a filler item for every single register reward that you use. Um, but let's say you have a, a cart that has five items with coupons and five items without coupons, then you're going to need, um, and say you have five register rewards, then you won't need any filler items because the items in your cart that are um, that don't have coupons with them, those register rewards can go for those items. So that those are just little examples that might confuse you even more. But um, anyway, like I said, just take them with you and just take the filler items to the register with you. Worst case, you just keep handing them to the cashier. So I hope that helps you guys out, and thank you for watching. Mm -hmm.